Yo, what up you cats, my escape 20 here, and today guys what I have for you here today is Mad Moxie's Arena number 2 bosses, and uh, what this is, is off of the Mad Moxie DLC, um, the Underdome, and what this, basically how it works, if you didn't pick up on the first one, there's gonna be 5, um, rounds, and then 5 waves in each round, and on the 5th rage wave of, uh, each round, there's a boss fight, so there's 5 total, um, and that's how it works, so, there's buffs and um, debuffs and all that kind of stuff that make it a little bit more challenging. I definitely think the third arena is probably the most challenging. That's just because the buffs are a little bit more extreme. Um, but you're going to see here in a little while. Well, not in this video, but maybe in the next video. So um, what I'm going to talk to you guys about is my channel's um, current status right now. And maybe why I haven't been posting lately. And what I hope to do in the future to help bring more videos to this channel so uh first thing let's talk about why i haven't been posting so for those of you know or for those of you that don't know as well i currently work at gamestop and um i i love it i love gamestop a lot and the problem was is i wasn't getting enough hours and when i say enough hours i mean i was working one shift a week if that it sometimes one shift every two weeks and that's a problem um, a lot of you guys will be like, oh, that's great, who cares, you get money and then you get discounts, but when you have to drive to school all the time and drive to work and have a girlfriend and, you know, like to save up for the Xbox One, I mean, I don't have money to get it yet, so I would like to work, you know, to get some money, so I didn't have an option and I had to get a second job, so I didn't want to give up GameStop because I want the discount and I enjoy working there, I come in happy and I leave happy, so what better way, um, I mean, what kind of, what other job could I ask for, you know? It's something I love. I sit there all, well, not sit there, but I, I go in and I get to talk about things I love. So why not? I mean, that's that's an awesome job to me. So I got an additional job and it was at Ruby Tuesdays. And I love it. Ruby Tuesdays is a lot of fun. Um, the job's okay, but the people I work with are a lot of fun. They bring a lot of um, excitement to the job, which sounds kind of weird being a host. You're like, how is that exciting? But the host people I work with are a lot of fun. They're really energetic and they're hilarious. So I really enjoy it, especially on like Friday and Saturday nights when we're busy and we have a multiple host there. And then we all, it's just like one big hangout party. Um, the managers aren't strict at all. They're just like, yeah, as long as you get your job done, you guys can have a good time. It's fine. Just don't, you know, get in the way of customers and all that stuff. So that's pretty fun. Um, I enjoy that part about my job. But yeah, so I've been working a lot there. And I haven't really had time. Also, New Year's uh, just came up, and I had to do stuff with my girlfriend, you know, because females are big into that kind of stuff. So, um, <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. But, uh, so, I don't know. I just had to do that, and I finally got today to sit down and do it. So, I'm really excited to be commentating again. Um, but that leads me into my next subject, where I'm running out of videos. And that's, um, that's kind of a problem, because normally it wouldn't be a problem, because I just pop in a game. And record but um, for those of you that don't know I think I announced it on Twitter but not everybody follows me on Twitter so if you do want to follow me on Twitter links below um, also at the end of the video it tells you my at mention name or whatever so um, it's at my 20 but uh, I have decided to um, currently take an extended break from COD um, and which is is a shame because I started the Road to Pro series just like I started the Minecraft series. It was going good, <laughs> and I just stopped because I get bored of it. And uh, the problem with Call of Duty is I've been playing it for so long um, that each year it doesn't compare to any other years. It really doesn't. Um, take Modern Warfare 2, um, for example, and then look at COD Ghost. Now, that's kind of, I mean, that's a pretty big difference. Now, I'm not saying Modern Warfare 2 is perfect. There's a lot of noob tubes and stuff like that. But, um, I mean, it's just like, you can at least use different guns and do well. If you don't use a marksman rifle or the MSBS, or maybe the Remington, or, if, you know what I'm saying. There's a lot of overpowered guns um, that I don't enjoy. And I don't play pubs, for those of you um, that don't know. I don't play Domination. I don't play that new game type that gives you more health. I don't play that, because... No offense, but pubs are just a bunch of, not everybody, but there's a lot of people that just camp and just care about KD and like, how wow, how is that fun? So um, what I've been doing is I've been, uh, you know, just kind of taking a break from COD. I've been playing a game called League of Legends, 
And that's brought me a lot of joy. It brought me a lot of happiness. I'm starting to realize why I play a game if it just makes you upset um, more than it, more than you enjoy it. So that's kind of something I picked up, and that's why I decided to take a break from Call of Duty Ghosts. Uh, currently on Borderlands 1, I only have 10 videos left, and I know you're like, 10 videos? But, I mean, when you're a commentator, 10 videos goes by like that, especially when you try to upload every day. That's like a week, and I know I've been doing a pretty poor job, but I'm going to try to get back into it. Um, these just past couple videos have been kind of bland to me, so uh, they're just kind of talking videos, which is, which is, I like having talking videos, but I'd rather have like the informational type awesome videos um, rather than just ramble. But, um, yeah, so... I don't have that many stuff left, and then I don't have anything else to post. Um, Borderlands 2, unless they come out with a Headhunter pack, I don't have anything to post with that. Um, the game, to me, is just, I've beaten it so many times, I couldn't possibly do a walkthrough on it. There's just no way I don't think I could just sit down and play it. Um, maybe, maybe, but I just, I highly doubt it. Um, so that's just, that's just me, though. Um, but I don't have a good enough computer to really like stream and like beast quality So that's kind of why I haven't streamed and as well as my stream thing ran out the I use XSplit and the reason I use XSplit is because my Aver Media doesn't work with OBS So that's why I have to use XSplit and the only good XSplit is the full um, premium one the highest one So uh, that kind of ran out and I have a free three month um, pass I got so I'm just saving that for when Destiny comes out or Tales of the Borderlands comes out, which is another thing I'll be talking to you about. Tales of the Borderlands hasn't actually had a release date, but Destiny comes out, um, and I know this because I work at GameStop, but it comes out 9-9-14. So September 9th, 2014 is the official date for Destiny. Um, it is street dated, which means the company says, yes, it will be out on this day. So, um, Stanley, are you snoring? Okay, anyway. Um... That's my dog. So, uh, <laughs> so I'm really excited about that. There's actually some things I can post on that, but like I said, it's not for nine months, and I'm not gonna go without posting for nine months. So I have to find things that maybe fill in. So what I was thinking about doing is maybe you know getting my girlfriend or a couple buds over and maybe do some like, uh, like just random games with face cam. Maybe like some scary games. Like try to freak out my girlfriend a little bit. Maybe just try some new things out. Um, let me know what you guys think. It'd be really appreciated. Um, if you let me know your opinions in the comments below. So, yeah, let me know. So, previous video is an Arena 1 boss video from Borderlands 1. Uh, Mad Moxie's Underdome. I definitely recommend you checking that out. And featured video is the introduction to this whole DLC. I definitely recommend um, checking this out as well so you can understand what this whole thing is about. So, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a thumbs up. Also, best way to contact me is on Twitter at MyHeroScape20. Also, you can check the link below. And if you want to see me play this game live, go to twitch.tv slash MyHeroScape20. So, thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. I really do. Um, hang in there. I'll be posting more videos as soon as I can. And thanks for watching. So, I'll see you in the next video. Alright, peace!